Hi guys, in this video I am going to discuss about a tribal Nikki series in C language. So, at here I am going to take uh, a 7 integer variable, first is int a1. So, I am going to initialize a1 with 0, next a2, initialize with 1, a3, initialize with 2. Now here after add initialize with 0 i and n. Now next uh, let's write printer function. So I'm going to print masses intro any number. And here after write a scanner function percentage ampersand and next uh, we need to write uh, printer function again and here uh, or percent d last percent d or slash t percent d and again slash t and here after display a1 value a2 value and a3 value and uh, next uh, write uh, for the so at here I am going to uh, start i value 3 and uh, check the condition i less than and i plus plus and here after add equal to a1 plus a2 plus a3 and here after printer function again and uh, percent d or slash d add and here after a1 equal to a2 and a2 equal to a3 and a3 equal to add and here after so this is the program of Tribaniki series in C language so let's so run the program So at here I am going to enter or 10. So see at here this is uh, at here 5 number and this one 5. So till 10 this is uh, displaying the series. So what uh, Tribuniki series are? So at here I initialize a1 with 0, a2, 0, a3, 2. And here I am displaying the value of a1, a2, a3. So, Tribuniki series is start from 0, 1, 2 and hereafter if you add this number then or uh, that come 3 and if you add this 3 number so that come 6 and if you add this 3 number so that come 11 and if you add add here or uh, this 3 number so that come 20. So at a Tribuniki series or uh, adding t num uh, 3 number and that the sum of 3 number that the resultant of Tribuniki series. So here you can uh, give uh, n 7. So if you give 7, so this is uh, till 7 that display Tribuniki series. Next I am going to discuss about the try and method of this program. So at here if you debug the code control comes to main function here after that go inside. So at here I have taken 7 integer variable first is a1 and initialize with 0 here a2 initialize with 1 a3 initialize with and here after 3 more variable add i n so add initialize to 
0. And here after i n n. So here after control comes to print a function. So what do we double code that display into the output screen? Enter any number. So that display into the output screen. A scanner function. Then whatever I am going to enter. So that received by n. So I am going to enter n value 6. So if you enter n value 6. Add here. Let's enter n value 6. So you will get this output. So here after control comes to printer function. So this rest or percent is for A1 and this percent is for A2 and this one for A3. So that is rest T. So that is 8 character space. Here after control comes to for loop. So at here I value start from 3. And uh, check the condition 3 less than n value 6. So condition is true so that coincides so at here add equal to a1 plus a2 plus a3 so n value is 0 0 plus 1 plus 2 so then the value come 3 so at here add value is now 3 and print print a function so that print add value so first time that print a1 a2 a3 value at here so 0 next uh, that print 1 2 and here after that print add value. So add is 3. So 3 print. And here after a2 value go to a1. So a2 value is go to 1. 1 go to a1. And a3 value go to a2. So 2 comes to this point. Here after add go to a3. So add value is 3. That comes 3. Here after a uh, loop continue. So i gonna increase. So i is 4 now. Or check the condition for less than n value 6. Condition is true, so that coincides so at add equal to an plus a2 plus a3. 1 plus 2, 3, 3 plus 3, 6. So add is now 6 or this time. So at here print add value. So add value is so 6. So at here 6 print. Here after a2 value go to a1. So at here 2 come. a3 value go to a2. So 3 value, so that go to and add value go to a3. Here after i increase, so i is now 5 and uh, i is 5. Here check the condition 5 less than 6. Condition is true that coincide. So at here add equal to a1 plus a2 plus a3. So a1 value is 2, a2 value is 3, a3 value is 6. So 2 plus 3, 5, 5 plus 6, 11. So add is now 11. And here after that print add value. So add value is now 11. So 11 print. Here after a2 value go to a1. So a2 value is 3. 3 go to a1. And a3 value go to a2. So 6 comes to this point. Here after add value go to a3. So 11 come there. Here after i is now 6. That check 6 less than 6 condition is not true. So that not coincide. Here after control comes to this point. Return 1. So at here process return 1. And next that out from main function. So when you enter n value or 6. So this output you will get. So if you enter n value 7. Then what will happen? One more time condition true. So that add. Condition true, then add a1, a2, a3. So 6 plus 3, 9, 9 plus 11, 20. So add is now 20. And here that display add. So 20 display. And here after a2 value go to a1. So 6 comes to this point. a3 value go to a2. So add here 11 come. And add is now a3. So 20 comes to this point. And here after i is now. 6 to 7. When i value is 7, check the condition 7 less than 7, condition false, so that out from for loop. And that return 1. And hereafter that out from main function. So if according to n, the output changes. So if you into 10, then output till 10, that display or Triboniki series. So this is the trend method of this program. So I hope guys. 
you understand the steps of execution so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next video